Hey guys, welcome back to Half Fast 719. Looks like uh, the whatever you call it, the Bobcat Fire is pretty much gone, thankfully. Came pretty close, like I said in the last video. Wife and kid had to evacuate. Sheriff came down the street telling everybody to leave. So, still smoky out. You can still smell campfire. But, uh, you can still see a little bit burning over there. But, for the most part, it's gone. A kid and me went up on top of that hill. And uh, checking it out, there was a fire yesterday right in between those that valley. But anyway, for the most part, air air quality is not the best, but I'll take it. It's clear, clean. But yeah, that mountain, basically the whole mountain is burnt. Oh, mountain. All oh, that is burned. That's the bobcat fire. And then up and over that section of the mountain. But anyway. Got some uh, plans for the day. Gonna go grocery shopping with the wife. Um, <sighs> but I think... We can, well, we're gonna check, but pretty sure we can unload our trailer with all the crap in it. Look at that beast. The drunken ram. The drunken mega cab ram. I have it all disconnected already. Alright, let's get to the video. This is, this is the plan for, for, uh, Whatever you want to call it. Um, all this crap's going to go into a... Uh, I got to recycle all this crap. The bumper, 4th gen bumper, still good. Um, possibly, probably going to do a 4th gen bumper conversion, whatever, on my brother-in-law's truck. That's why I'm saving it. That's why I haven't sold it yet. All this metal scrap. I'm going to try to sell these exhaust manifolds. And this cat, um, catalytic converter, exhaust manifolds, um, because it's California and people need this stuff and uh, they're not cracked or broken. So those I'll put aside, that I'll put aside, pretty much everything else, pretty much everything else in that pile um, is going to go in the shipping container. No, it's not. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all that scrap, take those doors, cut all this scrap, um, all the scrap metal. Um, I'm going to put it all on the flatbed, on the flatbed trailer. I'll throw it all, pick this bed up, Put this bed on that trailer. I'm gonna. I have to take this this piece off because uh, I'm gonna use it for wheel covers. Um, cab, the bed, full of scrap. All this scrap. Um, core support, everything on this stupid truck um, is gonna go to the scrap. Um, probably what I'm going to do. Is I'm gonna take this truck this whole chassis and everything and I'm probably gonna park it I'm probably gonna end up parking it somewhere back here farther I might just come back with the tractor I gotta get rid of all this wood all this scrap stock uh, wheels for the first gen and hubcaps and uh, beauty rings 
anybody needs any of those for their truck if they're doing a stock stock truck AC condenser for the Ram which yeah whatever can't use it it's for the Ram anyway that's gonna go to scrap scrap trash scrap trash 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 check out my neighbor's collection Got a Land Rover Land Rover, Mercedes, three Mercedes, BMW wagon, right there, another BMW, and looks like a little MG. Keeps his uh, keeps his yard pretty clean. He obviously has a little more time than me. Um, anyway, I'm just basically I'm clean, gonna clean up. I'm, I'm sick of the mess. Uh, project crack pipe is pretty much all done and uh, yeah I'm pretty sure 99% sure I don't need any more parts off of this truck cab bed I don't need anything so this is all gonna go to a scrap a scrap pile um because nobody I got it on offer up. I got it on uh, the Craigslist, and uh, nobody wants it, so it's just gonna go. Um, I'm gonna talk to the wife, see if she thinks we can put, if she wants to put this window in the shipping container. If not, I'm taking all these, all those are going to dumpster. Doors with glass, everything, dumpster. The wood's gonna go. Um, yeah, so anyway, thing with the shipping container is I'm gonna use this shipping container for uh, two, two purposes. This video's gonna be long and I'm all over the place. Sorry guys. Stay together, stay, stick with me. So what I'm gonna do is there's power there. So I'm gonna come off of there, or I'll just go into there, I'll get another box or whatever. And come in, I'm gonna dig a trench over to here. And then come up about, I don't know, maybe eight or 10 inches, drill a hole, run some power into there. I might even come up higher, um, you know, run it down and then run it straight up and then go up so no animals, bugs, or whatever can get in there, cock the crap out of it, and then uh, I'm going to run, I think I'm going to do four lights, four lights, one or two outlets on it, and then uh, I'm going to go get a couple uh, solar vents that pull the heat out, um, these little tiny vent things, these are like some weird type of waterproof vent. It's like a one-way, one-way diverter valve. So if it builds pressure, air will come out. I believe from what I've researched. So it's got four of these. One, two, three, four. So uh, it should have plenty of air. If not, I'll put a the little ceiling vents will be just fine because I'm gonna do. Two of them. I'm going to do one for now, um, if I can get it. If not, then I'll uh, have to order them on the eBay. They're cheaper on the eBay anyway. Anyway, so uh, this is all going to Goodwill, besides the table saw. And I got to go through all this crap. The chairs the wife wants to keep. A bunch of other furniture crap. Um, the engine stand. I'm going to put it behind the garage by the ladders. And that armor is going in there. That armor is going to go in there. And I'm going to pack them. This one's already packed full. So I'm going to have to empty all that out. But I'm going to pack that one. Um, and then pretty much just go through everything else and just purge. Just uh, get rid of crap. Put it on offer up, Craigslist for free. 
Um, no, I'm not. I'm not selling my tractor. It's my little workhorse. Although now my fuel tank is leaking, so I'm either gonna have to buy a fuel tank or uh, fix that one. It'd be kind of cool if I can uh, find something in that uh, size configuration that's aluminum. But anyway, um, yeah, and then basically uh, my emissions crap. Basically everything in here, all my emission stuff that I need for the truck is going to go in the shipping container. The Audi stock wheels and tires will go in the shipping container. Um, the press, some of those boxes I'll put on the side once I move the truck. Um, but yeah, pretty much what uh, my plan is, is I think we're going to end up not tearing this down, but I think we're going to end up uh, doing some framing some drywall turn this into a living space eventually i don't see it happening within this year or next year but um we have that enclosed patio right there and my kids bedrooms right there but anyway this enclosed patio right there has a lot of uh, my wife's stuff a lot of business stuff in there that she runs her little thing and uh what she doesn't use is going to go in the shipping container. What she does use for the business is going to go in the shipping container towards the front so she can just open the door and go to it. And then like her clothes and stuff or whatever will go. Basically my kids room is going to be kind of like a sewing room. And then my kids, my kid will stay in this 20 by 20 uh, little patio thing that I'm going to have to redo the siding. I kind of want to do uh, stucco. I want to get rid of this back door on the back. Replace these windows. That window is double pane. The other windows are not. Uh, maybe they are all. I can't remember. But anyway, I want to put new windows in there. Stucco this, do stucco. Um, I don't know. It's all up in the air. But anyway, got the shipping container so that I can uh, just do some stuff. Like we got appliances here, a dishwasher, washing machine, washing machine that was in my garage that was giving us problems. Um, I'm probably just gonna end up selling it. Dishwasher, I'll probably just end up selling that, even though the wife doesn't want to. But we got it for free when we bought something. I don't remember what we bought. Oh, our stove. They gave us a. Well, uh, dishwasher for free and uh, our house doesn't have a dishwasher <clears throat> um, it does but she's uh, taking a shower right now but anyway uh, yeah I just want to clean up all of this crap all this oil and stuff's gonna go into the side compressor I don't know I don't know about all these all this stuff it's all like I said it's all up in the air um, because, uh, yeah, if you guys can see, this wall is all bowed and buckling. So, we'll eventually take down all this crap. All this crap's going to be taken down. And, uh, and yeah, and basically just, it's going to turn into, uh, all this wood's going to come out. We're going to put in uh, two by fours all the way around it, frame it all, even though it's not, it's all structural steel already. So we're just going to do two by fours, do pressure treated wood on the bottom, glue all that down. Then we'll do two by fours, we'll build little walls or whatever we got to do. Um, and then eventually, yeah, frame it side it. I don't know what I'm going to do with the siding. I kind of want to do metal siding. I don't know. I don't know. Too much work. Too much of everything. But uh, eventually. Probably do all this crap and then my kid will end up buying a house somewhere. And uh, he'll move out. Or, well, I'll get so sick of California. I'll leave. 
But anyway, that's the plan. I gotta go do some shopping, go buy some lights, some adapters, conduit stuff. And, uh, yeah, the kid's gonna help move all the crap out of the barn into there. And then, uh, hopefully we'll start moving some of his stuff into that room. And then my wife can move her stuff into that room. And everybody will be happy, says the guy doing all the work. But anyway, alright guys, that's going to be it for this video. Make sure you guys subscribe, comment below, tell me what you guys think. Should I just start from scratch and build a big old thing? Should I save the money? Either way, I think this is already going to be cheaper with the barn. But, whatever. Um, yeah, I just got a lot of cleaning up crap to do too. Tools. Got all the wiring ready. Alright guys, subscribe, comment. See you guys on the next video. Next video. Maybe this truck will be running. Subscribe. Follow. Check out Project Crack Pipe on the playlist. Alright guys, later.